video number six. Again, here at break at work. I was at the gym this morning and uh, I just remembered where I started to where I was at and I was doing RDLs and, and, and Bulgarian hip dips and whatever. And I remembered not wanting to do them because how dumb it, I think I looked doing them. And then eventually I hit a point where I was more concerned with results than caring about how dumb I look in the gym. And I realized most of the times, especially at my gym, nobody's paying attention to what you're doing. Um, everyone's focused on what they're doing. And I said, if anything, you get lucky enough that you actually meet someone who's willing to uh, help you out. Help you out with your, your workouts and 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 help you out to the point that they're willing to, to show you how to do workouts correctly so you're, you have the proper form and stuff like that but you know I used to worry about so bad about being uh, looking dumb and things of that nature and just realizing that at the end of the day it's all about results and, and, and getting the proper form and is uh, you learn that by making the mistakes because uh, you don't no one gets it perfect the first time, especially when you're trying to figure it out by yourself. Um, so anytime you feel like in the gym, yeah, I should try that workout. They say it could help with this. No, nah, but I'll look dumb doing it. Just do it. No one's paying attention. And if they are, they happen to notice you more than likely if, if it's a gym like mine. Uh, shout out to Powerhouse Gym and Benefee. Um, somebody might happen to point out proper technique so that you can get it right and you don't hurt yourself and or get the best of your results. And I've met a few people that I'm actually cool, real cool with over that. And uh, they've told me that they respect me enough for being open to, to hearing critiques. And it's it's important when you're trying to, to, to do something. Uh, I learned that with music as well. Listening to so many people who came before you who are in the same position as you, who even guys out that were just starting out, they have, might have things figured out that you don't have figured out. And, you know, you, you, it, you learn by constantly always being a sponge. Um, you don't learn by thinking you know everything. I, I always get in a conversation with someone who acts like that when they know everything. I just look at them and I just shake my head like, how can you know everything and be in the position you're in? If anything, we're supposed to be trying to learn and be absorbing and, and, be, and be a student with life. And you can't be a student with life if you're constantly feeling like you know everything. Uh, if someone tries to tell you to do something or try to help you with doing something, you say, I know, that shit frustrates me because how can you know if you're making the mistake? You know? So it's like, it's important to be able to, 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 to humble yourself in moments where people are giving you gain and, and take that gain and apply it to life and apply it to what you're trying to do. You know what I'm saying? Don't reinvent the wheel. Just make the wheel works for you. You know what I'm saying? And there's a lot of people that, that have figured out things that you never even thought about. And instead of being so on the offensive and being offended and being like, oh my God, they're trying to say that I I, uh, I, I don't know what I'm doing. It's like, well, I mean, it's okay to not know what you're doing. The whole point is at the end of the day, uh, out of all of it, is to eventually um, get to a place where you're, um, you're, you're winning at the end of the day. And we all got to stumble somewhere, but you, you stumble and you get back up. You know what I'm saying? And just apply that to life, man. Like, apply it to everything you're trying to do in life, whether it be the gym. Uh, music or whatever you're trying to pursue. Just don't feel like you know everything. Just learn. I said, I, I've been a victim of it myself. Again, at the end of the day, we're all human and we all want to do better. Well, we should want to do better. But I'm not preaching to you. Again, I'm just the average guy just trying to do better. Until next time.